Hey there guys, how's it going? Hope everyone is doing fine. Welcome to my YouTube channel. So today we are going to learn Dhruv Vrati inspired video editing style. So I've gone through tons of videos from his infotainment arsenal and these are the few things, few features that I found very common and repetitive in all of his videos which we are going to talk about in this particular video. Alright, so without any further ado, let's get into the video. Alright, so now I'm in front of my screen and we've just logged into canva.com. Let's go ahead and select a video blank canvas over here. Now the first thing what Drew Vrati really does in his videos is remove green screen, right? So we are going to do that. I've downloaded this particular video uh, from YouTube. I got it in YouTube and we are going to try to remove the green screen green screen from this particular video okay and to do that you have to go to edit video background removal and voila the green screen is gone and you can just play around and this is the video and that's the first step green screen removal all right so let's move to the second step uh, let me open my notebook I've noted down somewhere okay yeah article highlighter so we are going to do article highlighter it's very simple guys so I'm going to show you right now and to do that article highlighting let's go to one of the article this is one of the article that I was going through earlier and we're going to change the font to Times New Roman and let us also you know download our Deccan Herald or maybe Times so let me go ahead and select it from our uploads to the images and yes this is the logo and now what we are going to do is we are going to edit this logo remove the background all right so this is our article now what we are going to do is we are going to do the highlighting thing let's go over here let's take a shape okay we're going to change the color of the shape to maybe a highlighter color something like yellow or orange or maybe this one okay to the back and voila that's our highlight now let's go ahead and animate the same okay we're going to go to positions click on the layer and we're going to go to animate let's do a wipe animation okay and maybe we'll decrease the speed okay i love the speed you can further go ahead and edit more it looks smooth let us let us play it one more time perfect so the third feature we are going to talk about is called the morph effect okay so it's a very common effect that Dhruv Rati uses uh, throughout his video repetitively so we are going to do that so for that what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and maybe search for Taj Mahal images okay okay and we're going to use this one okay now to do that let me first increase the size but rather what I'm going to do is I'm going to crop it something like this for the sake of our video to use it in our video right I'm going to crop it and make it to a size that I like for our particular template all right so after this I'm going to edit the photo go to background remover and that's going to remove the background clean it off all right so it's clean it's wonderful right we're going to place it right about over here and let's say let's go to our title and let's write it down right about here yeah looks perfect to me right you can also change the color you know how to do that you can go ahead and change the color from here but i think uh, for our purpose i think i like it the way it is okay now we are going to animate this let us do a baseline rise okay baseline rise and i'm going to decrease the speed because i want that subtle 
baseline rise moment because uh, that looks very aesthetic right let us go ahead and re-watch the baseline rise we're going to go over here perfect i love it right it's perfect now let's go to taj mahal and we will also go ahead and animate this as well so for taj mahal let's go over here maybe we'll do a typewriter uh let me see what else i can do let's do a rise but this time we'll do it from the top uh maybe i would first like the taj mahal to come okay which let us increase the speed by a bit and then maybe we would want the taj mahal text to come and align in our uh, frame okay looks nice all right let us review that looks perfect but it's a 3.3 second uh, video we would cut it down to maybe 2 seconds we do not want that long right people lose interest in a longer video right we are going to copy this and duplicate it in the next page as well now what i am going to do is i am going to resize and uh, let's go ahead and search for a line now let's go ahead and copy some text from our taj mahal wikipedia okay so this is some of the information of the taj mahal that i want these are some of the information about our taj mahal right and mind you you can use any font we are going to use times new roman and this is our text and this is taj mahal now what i am going to do is i am going to animate this one let's say type right maybe let's do a type right animation all right the speed is too much i am just going to slow it down a little bit perfect even this looks perfect okay now let's go ahead and click over here over here we are going to add transition between these two these these two canvases okay so to do that we are going to use match and move okay and i'm going to show you the magic of match and move okay let's play it one more time all right perfect Now a lot of time you see these kind of effects in Dhruv Rathi's infotainment videos right so this effect is called morph effect let's go to our next feature now the next feature that i am going to show you is the light leak transition uh, let me shorten this down and i am going to add one more over here right over here and we are going to search for a video of Taj Mahal right zoom in video effect so we are going to take this and it's a very long video let's shorten it down not from there maybe i would like to shorten it down from right about here uh, i'm going to place this empty layer inside of in between over here and i'm going to take another one of taj mahal's video now a close up shot Now let's try it out. Now what I am going to do is in this empty layer I am going to place a light leak effect. Okay. Let's go to our videos and we're just going to select one light leak effect. Perfect. Perfect. Short 
putting it down a little bit more i'm very sorry i'm very you know certain about things voila now that was a a very seamless transition right with our light leak effect so this is the effect which dhruv rati uses a lot now obviously they use all this effect in a video editing platform like say example premiere pro or davinci resolve but uh, to make it easier i'm showing you all these effects in canva lot of hard work put together to piece all these things together so please go ahead and give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel that would really help me a lot all right so after all that shameless promotion <laughs> we are going to go to our next feature let's go ahead and search for world map all right so this is the map that i will be selecting oh, again i won't make it a background layer let's try to play this and maybe we'll do a breathe animation for that let's do a scale so for that we'll have to do a bigger one scale it more okay right now let's go to our start point okay nice yes so it's evenly animated let's copy this layer we are going to we are going to duplicate the same layer and here let's make it maybe 2 second india go to highlight let's go ahead and search for india map okay let's use this one okay i'm going to use this one because it's got some nice segregation okay i've seen my grid let's go ahead and zoom it a little more such that it fits Okay perfect let's go ahead and zoom in now okay so that's our india map let's also try to give some effect to our india map we are going to first change the color of our india map let's say that uh, event you know that's crucial to india is happening right now india so we are going to show it with red color okay so that's the red color and let's go ahead and animate this to breathe want our india map to breathe and start growing out okay so something like this so that let's set our initial size a little bit more okay right so that's the animation and what i'm going to do is again i'm going to uh, click on match and move transition let's try it out okay let's play the entire thing perfect but the match and move uh, i think the transition that is how much i get over here in the timer let's play it out perfect all right so that is how you do map animation now let's go to our next feature okay the next feature is sound effects the now sound effects is a completely creative process it's completely on you how you you do the sound effect but i can give you a gist uh, in canva you can go to the audio layer over here maybe a typing effect you know typing sound and it's going to give you see that's the typing sound right or a wind sound maybe a whoosh whoosh transition sound so we have all these sounds let me show you one you know it's completely on you how you are going to use it it's on your creativity you've got tons of tons of sounds available in uh, canva itself because i think it's uh, associated with epidemic sound which is one of the best industry standard sound you know most of the creators use from there so you can avail it here in canva 
those are the things I could find. Yeah, uh, there's one more bonus thing that I want to show you. He also uses overlays. Okay. So that is it from this video. Hope you like the video. If you really like the video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Support your brother. Help your brother out. So that I get motivated to put more and more bite-sized knowledge golden nuggets just for you guys in this particular channel. That is it from this video. Bye-bye. Have a great day.